West Lafayette is getting several thousand new residents over the next few days. That's because Purdue freshmen are moving into their dorms. Star City's Nina Sloshberg has more on how families feel about this new transition. What's it like, you know, moving into college for the first time? Um, you know, it's a little nerve wracking. I think I have a little too much stuff, so I kind of feel bad for these guys that are moving me in. Um, it's so I'm like the third kid, so my mom, but the first girl, and my mom just wanted to pack everything, and it's different than my brothers for sure. It's the first daughter, so a little bit different. As you can see, there's two cars full of stuff versus a box and a hanging bag for the boys. Uh, so it's a little different uh, planning for a girl move in versus a boy move in. That's for sure. What are you looking forward to most out of the college experience? Oof, just the amount of stuff I'm going to get to explore. I ha I'm really excited about all the theater opportunities. I've already gotten to see at Purdue, and I can't wait to see what else is in store. Right, and is this the first kid you're dropping off at First home? kid we're dropping off, yes. It's a little bit nerve-wracking, but mostly, you know, we've raised her and hope that she's going to be trustworthy, so just time to let her go and let her do her thing. We're excited for her. We, we think she's going to do an awesome job here, and she's ready. So what's it like moving, you know, away from home and into the dorm room for the first time? Um, it's kind of, I mean, it's exciting, but it's also nerve-wracking at the same time. Never lived away from my mom, so that'll be different, but I'm excited for the new experience and to get a little bit more independent. I'll probably cry all the way home. <laughs> Four hours on the way back, but uh, it'll, I'll miss her a lot. I mean, it's just been us two for the last couple years, so it'll be sad. Empty nester.